Hi there, welcome to my new tutorial. My name is Andre Kroeker from Dagubi. Today I would like to show you how to create these two design elements. Ok, the first thing what we need to do is create these three brushes. It's very simple. Create with the ellipse tool new oval with black fill. Now with the direct selection tool select the left and the right point and convert it to corner. Select this both points and move it to the left. OK. The second brush is create a circle. Now select this left point, move it to the left like this. And now hold the ALT key and drag this handle so and this handle so. OK, now I'm going to create this brush, create a new circle. Now move this circle by holding the ALT key, move it here and scale it smaller. So, OK. Now select this both shapes and click on Vertical Align Center. Now go and choose this Blend tool. Click on this circle and this. Now go to Objects, Blend and choose the Blend Options. Click on Specify Steps and make it to 8 steps. Yes, 8 steps is OK. Click OK. Now go to Objects and um, Blend and click on Expand. So now we need to reflect this shape. Go and choose the Reflect tool. Now click by holding the ALT key on the center from this circle. OK, and the axis is vertical and click on Copy. So now we have here two circles. Delete this one. So next, scale this shape smaller. And now I'm going to make uh, brushes from these shapes. First, select this shape drag it into the brushes panel and click on art brush ok and the colorization method change it to tints ok make the same with this brush art brush ok and tints ok or you can select the shape go to panel options and click on new brush art brush ok and tints. But this brush, it's um, important to change the brush scale up change, set it to scale proportionately. OK. So new, now we have here these three brushes. And the brushes look so. OK, I start with this design element, create a new layer, choose this first brush, fill is none and black stroke color. Now 
make a double click on the paintbrush tool and these are my um, options for the brush. Okay, and the stroke thickness is one point. Okay, I start with this big swirl. So next create here second swirl. Now go and change the stroke thickness to 0 0.5 point and create here a new swirl and here. Change the stroke thickness to 0 0.25 point and create we are here and here Change it again to 0 0.5 point and create here a new wheel. So next select this brush and create here an arc. Change the stroke to 0 0.25. So next select this brush and create here a new line. Oh sorry. It's important to change the stroke thickness to one point. And choose this first brush. 0 0.5 point and create here okay next I'm going to create a second shape this design element create a new layer Choose the paintbrush tool, set the stroke thickness to 0 0.75 point. Choose this brush and create first this wheel. And this big wheel. Okay, move this a little bit and set this swirl to 0 0.5 points. Okay. Change the stroke thickness to 1 point and create here a big arc.
Now choose this brush, set it stroke thickness to 0.5 point and create here and here an arc. Last, choose this brush, set the stroke thickness to one point, And this three brushes here. If you like, you can make some corrections. So Now these are the final design elements. Next what we need to do is make a copy from this layers, select both layers and drag it down to this new layer button and now change the color from these two layers to light gray like this and now move this layer to the left and rotate it a little bit scale it bigger Now select this layer and move it to the right and scale it also, scale it. And place it here. That's it. Thanks for watching. If you liked this tutorial, please press thumbs up and share it with your friends. If you want to see more of my tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Hope to see you soon.